you've heard me talk about strawberries, but it's blackberry time in South Georgia, and I got the blackberry lady with How you doing, Laura? I'm good. Tell me about these blackberries you're growing. Well, we have come up with a new system to plant them on, and um, we're, we're trellising some of them. We have some of our original ones where you can pick on both sides, but um, these are unique because they lay down through most of the season, and when they set their blooms, we've got them turned so that they set the majority of them on one side, and then after they've set, we roll them back up, and um, so you can see all the berries set pretty much on one side, so the picking is very easy. Oh, yeah, yeah. May I try one? Yes, yeah, sure. Oh, let me try one. Look at this. Very simple. You get right to them. Mm, and with boy. the blackberry, when you're picking, mm -hmm. the ones that are shiny and black look like they're ready, but lots of times they'll be tart. But if they get kind of a um, not shiny, opaque look, that's when the then sugar. That's when, yeah, you can tell that's they're when right the sugar then. has come up mm -hmm. in them. Yeah. Now, how long will y'all have blackberries? Do you know? Um, usually we have them five or six weeks. We will have them all the way through the June, and most years that we go a week into July. So it's a good time to come mm -hmm. get them. Mm -hmm. Y'all furnish buckets? We do. We furnish a gallon picking bucket and you pick in it and then take it home. Heard something about peaches. You got some peaches? We do. We've got several varieties for the next three or four weeks. Same thing. We should have those through um, the end of June also. Laura, what are we looking at now? These are peaches. Peach, boy, those mm -hmm. are pretty. Yeah, they're just beginning to come in. We've had an early variety, um, but we've got several, so we'll have these on through the month of June, too. What, and um, we let people pick, and we usually have them already picked. So if you wanted them already picked, you would need to call and check to see. You can take a bag with you, can't mm -hmm. you? you? No problem. What what type are these? Do Is there a particular type? Um, we've got four or five different varieties. Um, there's some early ones, Gulf Prince and Gulf Crest. Um, we have red skin, and we have a variety that we're not sure what it is. It was supposed to have been nectarines, yeah. and they turned out to be peaches, but they're cling-free. We do know that, um, and they're the last one. They're toward the end of the month, and, and a lot of people are interested in the cling-free. What are we looking at now? And I'm telling you, folks, there's so much fruit here. It's got the limbs bent down on this tree. What is this? These are nectarines. We have several varieties of nectarines also, um, and they're they're ready. They're at their peak. You can come get them right now. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about what days of week y'all are open. Um, we're open Monday through Saturday from 8 to 7, and then on Sunday afternoon from 1 to 6. So bring the family, pick. Mm -hmm. bring. Uh, y'all got buckets if you don't we have do. them? We do. We do. And, yeah, if, if you want to pick, like, we do the gallon, or if you know if you really want a lot, we've got five-gallon buckets, or you can, can bring your own. You can buy a little or buy a lot. It don't mm -hmm. matter. Just come spend the time and have a good time. Tell them how to find you now. Um, we are on the Nashville Enigma Road. We are about four miles south off of 82. You just come through the little town of Enigma, um, and we are behind Berry and Peanut Company. You turn in right there, and we've got signs to get you back here to the field. Good to have you on. Thank you. See you next time.